A unique feature about the dome is that it is a water catchment area. Rainwater that falls in the neighborhood is collected in the drains and canals and eventually ends up in the Badok Reservoir. The reservoir was built in 1986 from a former sand quarry. Its surrounding park is a nice place for residents to relax and enjoy nature. One, two, three, go! Go! I say go! 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 But there's not only the park that you can enjoy, there's also the water and I'm all ready to jump right in. Paddles Inc. has opened Singapore's first kayaking outlet in a reservoir right in the heartlands. There are sit-on-top open decks, one- and two-seaters for beginners, as well as closed cockpit single- and double kayaks that are only for certified kayakers. So Charlene, what's the difference between kayaking here in a reservoir and out in the open sea? Well, it's very much safer here in the reservoir. Yeah, and it's a place where like families can go kayaking together and you can actually bring like really young children. They don't get that kind of experience out at sea because it's not allowed, at least not in Singapore. So that's why it's encouraged that we actually go kayaking in the reservoir and that's why we're here. So, so how do we get started? Um, mm -hmm. Do we just like sit down and like just like... <laughs> oh no, I'm not getting anywhere, am No, I? no, you gotta get up, yeah. One, two, three. <laughs> The outlet reaches out to schools, especially in the Eastern Zone, grassroots organizations, and residents in the East. I quite like this. It seems like Badok Reservoir is attracting all kinds of water sports enthusiasts. Besides kayaking, it is also used for dragon boating and water skiing. The annual HSBC Wakeboarding World Cup is also held here. Charlene and I are getting a bit too close for comfort. Can you please don't come and bang my canoe? <laughs> I, I'm just really worried that I may get eaten by a crocodile. You know, you just never know. I mean, like a crocodile could just come and bite my fingers. <laughs> oh, Charlene. Uh, yeah, go home now, mommy, where are you? <laughs> The water at the Reservoir is so calm, you don't have to worry about any, any waves or anything like that, strong undercurrent. Poof. Oh, Back on solid ground. Wow, what a workout. Paddling can make a man really hungry, so that's why I'm here at Block 85 where the Badok North Wet Market is. And all the famous stalls here, they open in the evenings and serve till 2 to 3 a.m. So they should be open right about now. Wow, look at this stall. It's called Sin Badok North Barbecue Chicken Wing. I'm, sh I'm sure it's sinfully good. The barbecue chicken wing stall here is really popular with the Badok community. Auntie, can I, can I order some chicken wings and, and an otah as well, please? Ooh, looking good. Okay, can I, I, just, I just try, I just try, I just try, I just try. Mmm, it's so good. It's very juicy and very crispy on the outside. Oh, this is delicious. Mm. Auntie, can I help you um, grill the chicken? Wow, it's very hot in here. Look at this. I'm grilling the chicken wings. I'm grilling the sinfully good chicken wings. It's like playing, you know, um, soccer. <laughs> but it's very, very hot in here. Whoa, this is intense. Auntie, I can I cannot take it anymore. I can um, in the outside. Wow, it's too hot. Auntie, can I order five more chicken wings, please? And two more otas. All for me. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Thank you, Auntie. Thanks. Thank you. Well, that's it for appetizers. Let's go for the main course. The only requirement I have for my main course is that it's delicious. 
and hey, I've seen this shop before, I think. Well, I've heard of it anyway. Look at all the awards it's won. Yeah. Hello, Uncle Wok. Can I order? Well, it's your E1. E1, but told me. Okay. <coughs> Xinji Wou Chuo Mian is so specialized that they only serve minced pork noodles and soup. Okay, looks like my noodles are ready. My bak chow mein, my very famous bak chow mein. Okay, I'm going to enter my mouth. Oh, hold on, hold on. Thank you, Uncle. Ah, okay, uh, thank you, Uncle. Thank you, Uncle. Thank you, Uncle. Okay, this is my main course. You know what? This is not enough. I think I need a side dish. Oyster omelette. Sounds like side dish of the day. Hello, Uncle. Ni hao. Oh. Okay, I can eat one oyster omelette. Hey. How? So, Uncle, how long has your store been around? Ti nian la ni chu oyster. Oh, this is fifty years now. Fifty years la. That's fifty years. I think I'm correct. Wow. Fifty years. Ah. In Bedok. No, in Bedok. In Katong. In Katong. Oh, at Katong. Okay, he his store used to be at Katong. No wonder I I thought I saw the word Katong in the on the signboard. Uncle, I can help you, sir. Can. Really? Come. Uncle's going to let me go into his kitchen. This is like you know your American breakfast but Singapore style. The oyster, ah. Okay, the good part, the oysters. Right, the funny oyster. Oh, this smells so good, and it looks so good. Wow. Okay. This is this. Hey, what is this? Long long long. Ah, this is this. Ah, long long long. Really? Right. I'm quite the big guy. Ah, you see. Okay. Well, that's it. Oh, thank you very much, Uncle. Thank you. Thank you. These side dishes du jour. Food glorious food. Now let's mix this up. Try my bat for me. Oh my god. You know what? It's all about the broth. Oh, it's almost time! That is so delicious. There's so much flavor packed in there. I've had a blast in Bado, so join me next week on Heartland Getaway. Bye bye!